I really think it's mostly about passion. Um, the like contributing factors, at least for me, it was to have passion towards going into drawing. Like, I have had no experience going into drawing, and I went from super amateur, not even like barely knowing how to draw a stick figure, to like drawing from still life and from models and portraits that big painters, like master studies, used to do. That I definitely did not see myself being able to draw in just three weeks. The most beneficial things for me in this course were how much the teacher wanted to go and help you, like really helped you go and look at your drawing, you know, and take a step back, right? And really pause and think about your drawing. Another thing was being able to go. And it's, again, for me, it was very much mentally, like, the mental process, it was very beneficial to like go and look at my drawing and being like, it's okay, I got this. This course was not taught anywhere in any of my schools that I've been to. The most you'll get maybe from other schools that I've been to at least is really just focusing on the detail and that's not what you need because you can have a drawing that's just a base, that's just a block in and have it look finished. When I went to other schools and we would do art classes, it was like, look at this and think of it as an eye, or look at this, it's a flower, or it's this, it's that sight recognition that you have. But here, you look at it as a shape. You have different shapes and you're like, okay, this isn't an eye, it's just a bunch of dark shadows and light shadows. Absolutely, I definitely think that I can apply this to my future in the arts um, that I wanna take. Right, because what I was saying, the base, you need it for every, this camp is honestly a camp that I will definitely be going to multiple times because you learn so much. It's, right, you have so much information packed into this super small box that takes three, four years of learning painfully slow, time-consuming learning into just three weeks. And it's crazy because you learn so much. I think I've actually learned like a lot about like the different techniques, like the different techniques has helped me a lot. Like even though it's been a span of three weeks, I've learned so much and it has really improved my drawings. Like my drawings were not as good as before. Yeah, so were you, is it something that you were expecting? No, I was not expecting this at all. I didn't think I'd make this one this much progress, but I'm really proud of myself and I am really happy that I joined this camp. Okay, what is the toughest part of the camp? Well, the toughest part, and I would say, honestly, the drawing's not that bad. It's like, you, it's pretty easy after um, you really obtain the information, but uh, I think like the toughest part is really just socializing because I am very antisocial. Yeah? Were you able to make friends? I was able to make really good friends in the end, and I'm really happy with that I got to meet these amazing people. Mm -hmm. Because they're all artists? Why do you think you're able to connect with other students? Because they have like a goofy personality that really like matches with me, like, and they make me really happy. They don't give me negative vibes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So will you, do you think you can apply what you learn in the summer camp for your future drawings? Of course, like in the past, like you have to use the reference to draw. And I never really, I've never really been able to, to like make my drawing and the reference like really accurate. But after I tried, like tried to do like a portrait at, at, at my house, like after a week of learning, and it was like really accurate, and I am really happy with the results. And I can use that for, like maybe art projects in my school because we have tons of art projects. I would say join it immediately. It you can learn a lot, and I feel like it would really benefit you if you're trying to like pursue an art career. I joined High School of the Arts camp, representational drawing. I thought it would be a, a little bit more easier and like not that hard, but it turned out to be like um, a really fun experience. Yeah. What was the most challenging part? In the um, I think charcoal because I've never really done charcoal before, and it was just something new. It's really fun. The food here is great, and and I learned a lot of new stuff.